Ông quý chọc. President, please be seated. The chamber is now back in session, and the chamber gives the floor to Defence Counsel for Ms. the accused Nunji to put questions to the civil party. You may now proceed, Counsel. Uh, thank you, Mr. President. <coughs> good afternoon, Your Honours, Council, and good afternoon, Madam Civil Party. Um, I have a few questions that I would like to put to you um, this afternoon. Uh, not very many, just a few. Um, I would like to start with asking you some follow-up questions in respect of um, the job or activities of your uh, former husband, or your late husband. Um, this morning I wrote down that you said uh, your husband, uh, quote, sold livestock, uh, such as ducks and chicken, unquote. Is that what you said this morning? Yes, I answered like that, that he sold livestock, namely chicken and ducks. He had no other jobs besides that. Um, so he was a merchant. Uh, did he trade in other goods, other materials, uh, other things uh, than livestock? Do you remember? He did not sell any other goods. He sold only the things I mentioned earlier. How about uh, medicine? Did he sell medicine to people? Question. Et des médicaments. Est-ce qu'il vendait des médicaments aux gens? No, he didn't. Non, répond le participant. This morning you were asked, um, and I think you said no, um, whether he Maître also Coppe, sold uh, opium to people. Lorsque l'on vous a demandé s'il vendait également de l'opium aux gens. Do you remember what you said? No, he didn't sell répond, opium. Non, il ne vendait pas. He sold only livestock, and that was it. No other business. Uh, are you sure, Madam Civil Party? Question, Madame de la Partie Civile, êtes-vous sûr? Yes. He did not sell. Any other goods? Il ne vendait rien d'autre. Um, let me confront you, or Maître rather Cooper, put to you uh, something you yourself said uh, to investigators of DC Chem. English ERN 011 57781 and Khmer 0003434081081. The DC Chem interviewer asks you the following question. Can you tell us again what your husband did at the time? And you answer, he did not do any business. At that time, he relied on the fact that Yun could enter and exit Cambodia. He was an opium seller. Do you remember saying this to DC I, I never told, I never said like that. I did not know 
what he sold. What I knew was that he sold livestock. I did not know that he said he sold opium. There, there was no opium at that time, said the, speaker, said the civil party. Um, I'm, not, I'm not sure about that, Madam um, Civil Party, but uh, do you have any... Je ne suis pas aussi certain, Madame de la Partie Civile. any reason that this investigator of DC Chem would write down that you had told him que vous that your former husband was a, uh, votre uh, an opium seller? Mari était vendeur d'opium. I never said like that because my husband did not involve in that business. Parce que mon mari n'avait rien à voir avec cette affaire-là. Uh, Madame Civil Party, um, when I just asked you a question whether he um, bought or sold medicine, Je vous you said uh, no, he didn't. Je vous ai demandé s'il vendait ou s'il achetait des médicaments. Vous m'avez dit non. Um, confront you with something that your younger sister told um, one of the DC camp investigators, present E3-6941, um, English ERN 41, l'interprète n'a pas saisi le when? milieu et ça se termine par 325. Mm -hmm. I will not read the whole question because I will come to Maître that question, je reviendrai un peu plus tard. Um, uh, La question est, avait-il sa propre entreprise si votre sœur yes, oui, il avait he sa propre affaire. Il a faisait passer des médicaments dans notre pays en contrebande et les Can vendait ici. Pourriez-vous réagir à ce qui a été dit par votre sœur cadette au CDCAM I don't know which of my which one of my sister you are referring to. Je ne sais pas à quelle sœur cadette vous faites my référence. I knew my husband did not sell Je sais que the mon thing you you were talking about. What I knew dit. was that he sold only livestock. That was what I knew. Ce que je savais, c'est qu'il vendait seulement du bétail. C'est ce que je savais. Uh, it was Din I. Your younger sister. Question, c'était Din Ai, votre sœur cadette. Who told DC Cam Qui a dit that your husband, or your former Cam husband, or your late husband, sorry, was involved in smuggling Marie, medicine? So that's an answer to your question. Um, Pour répondre à votre question. Let me ask you now um, what your uh, late husband did. Uh, before he came to your village. Um, à présent vous poser can you tell us something about that? What, what was his job or what were his activities before he came to Cambodia? Um, He, he sold livestock. He did not sell any other things. And during the Khmer Rouge regime, he performed the, the task that was assigned to him. No other business beside that. As I told you, he did not do any other business. Um, maybe my, my, my question wasn't very clear. Maître I was Coco, actually referring to um, his activities before he became a merchant. Je vous posais des But let me ask you a question um, directly. Was he, at question? one point in time, a, un moment donné, a member of um, a Vietnamese military unit? Il a été membre d'une unité militaire vietnamienne. Yes, he did. And then he came to live in Cambodia, but I did not know which location he came from. So he was in fact a 
um, Vietnamese soldier, correct? Question, donc c'était en fait un soldat vietnamien, exact? Yes, that is correct. Réponse, oui, c'est exact. Um, do you know um, for which Vietnamese army he was fighting? Question, et was he fighting pour either for the South Vietnamese troops il se battait? of Kyoti, que c'était pour les or was he a Kyoti, Viet Cong member fighting against um, qui the soldiers of Kyo? Contre les soldats de Kyo. I did not know whether he's a member, he was a member of Vietcong. What I knew was that he came to settle in my village. That's what I knew. I did not know which side he belonged to. Uh, I understand. Um, let me see if I can ask it differently to you. Um, was he someone who was a, um, a communist with um, not very much sympathy for Americans? était quelqu'un de uh, communiste qui n'avait pas beaucoup uh, and, or de soldiers. sympathie pour les soldats de l'ONOL ni instance. pour les impérialistes américains, par exemple. I do not know whether he was a communist or not. Because I lived in my village and he lived in other areas, so I did not know what he did prior to his coming to my village. Um, let me see if I um, can do it differently one more time. Um, is it correct that he had family members living in Saigon. Est-il exact qu'il avait des membres de sa famille qui habitaient à Saigon? Got no man. Yes, he had family members. Réponse, oui, il avait but des I membres de sa famille. Did not, I do not know what years his family members came to live there. Mais je ne sais pas en quelle année les Was membres de sa famille sont arrivés là-bas. Question, est-ce que Saigon? lui Was venait born aussi in Saigon? de Saigon Est-il né à Saigon He was born in Piem. His birthplace was at Piem. All his parents were also at Piem. Ses parents étaient également à Piem. When uh, the North Vietnamese Communist Army, together Question. with the Viet Cong, Lorsque took over Saigon on um, 30 April 1975, do you remember whether your husband was very happy or whether he was very sad? He, he was normal, but I do not normal. know which side that he served Et in the army for. Auprès de quel côté il a servi dans l'armée. I understand, Madam uh, Civil Party, uh, not any problem. Um, Je comprends, let Madame me move on to the next um, subject propose, this morning. Je passe au sujet um, suivant ce matin. I wrote down... J'ai noté an answer to a question from the prosecution. Une réponse que vous avez donné à l'une des questions posées par l'accusation. What happened to the Vietnamese siblings of your husband? 
aux frères et sœurs vietnamiens de notre marié. Je crois que ce uh, que vous quote, avez répondu, c'est qu'ils étaient vietnamiens dans sa maison. Quand vous avez dit ce matin, They were Vietnamese in his house. Lorsque quote, vous avez dit qu'ils étaient vietnamiens uh, dans sa maison, refer? à qui faisiez-vous référence They were not at my house. They were in other people's house. Ils n'étaient pas dans ma maison. Ils étaient dans la maison de quelqu'un d'autre. Were other people, not not my relatives. Ce n'étaient pas les membres de la famille. But they lived also in the same village. Ils habitaient également dans le même village. So they they did not live with me. N'habitaient pas avec moi. That is how I understood your answer, Madam Civil Party. But dans votre réponse, Madame la Partie Civile. I think you were referring to Vietnamese people living in your late husband's house. Is that something you said this morning? Were there other Vietnamese people living in your late husband's house? Yes, uh, there were people living in my house. They were oui, my husband's ma niece and nephews. Les et de mon mari. And I do not know where they are now. Et je ne sais pas où ils sont um, still not entirely sure if I understand. Maître Coppe, Were there je Vietnamese family members des membres de la famille vietnamien? of your late husband living in his house? Y avait -il des Other membres people de la from Vietnam? De votre mari, des membres vietnamiens, d'autres personnes du Vietnam qui habitaient chez votre mari? Man. Yes, there were. Réponse. They oui. came to live with me and my husband. Avec moi et mon mari. And later on, they went back. But I, do, I did et not know where rentrés, they went to. Mais je ne sais pas où ils sont allés. Uh, was that in 1975 Question when they returned? Question était en 1975 um, qu'ils sont rentrés. Remember this morning you spoke about um, ce matin, vous Vietnamese avez parlé people who had to return to Vietnam. Vietnam. Uh, were they among the ones who returned to Vietnam in 1975? I do not know the specific year they returned. What I knew was that they returned, but, but, not, but I could not remember the year. Uh, in other words, your late husband was the only Question, en termes, Vietnamese person votre mari, um, from his family who had stayed behind la seule personne de sa in Pochendam. Is that correct? À Pochendam. Est exact? Yeah. Yes, that is correct. He came to live in Pochendam. Il est venu vivre à Pochendam. Um, this morning, and I, I believe you also um, said that to investigators, um, you said that you uh, had urged your husband uh, to go back to Vietnam. Votre pré, votre mari à can, can you tell me a little bit? How that went? What was it exactly that you said to him, and why was it that he refused? Et pourquoi a-t-il refusé? He refused to go. He said that he would not go. Il a dit qu'il n'irait pas. He was. He said that. He's willing to die in Cambodia Il to die with me and my child. He would not go back alone. Cambodge, I told him that 
everyone je went back. Why didn't you go back? Lui ne pas. And he said that he, il a he would not go. Il ne he would pas. prefer to die in il Cambodia together au with Cambodge me and my child. Avec moi et notre Uh, thank you, uh, Madam Witness. Uh, let me move on to uh, another Question. Merci, subject, Madame and that is something um, you briefly discussed this morning as well. Chose que vous avez um, ce matin. And that is the period um, before la qui a April 75 or April maybe even a little earlier. Et um, même un peu avant. The period in, in history that is also sometimes referred to as the uh, Lon Nol era, 1970-1975. Do you remember, let me ask you differently, what do you remember about the 1975. treatment of people of Vietnamese origin au sujet de la façon dont on traitait les Vietnamiens entre 1970 et 1975 dans votre village? Okay. They were badly treated. They were Réponse. assigned to carry us On leur de and the la terre canals. Et de creuser des canaux. And that was what I knew because we didn't live together. Et we were assigned to work differently. President. Demandé de Madame, uh, the question is that between 1970 to 1975, that means before the Khmer Rouge regime, how was the Vietnamese people living in your village treated at that time? Answer. There, there, there was nothing happened to them. Il rien I cannot recall everything because it happened a long time ago. Do you know whether people of Vietnamese origin in your village uh, during the Lon Nol era were discriminated against? Question: Vous souvenez-vous si les gens d'origine vietnamienne dans votre village faisaient l'objet d'une discrimination? Well. Yes. People said that they were Vietnamese. Oui, les gens qu'ils Vietnamese. But they still lived in the area. Mais ils and quand même there was nothing région, happened to them. Et rien ne leur est I'm not entirely sure, Madam Civil Party, if you Maître correctly Koto, understand je ne suis pas certain, la um, the period that I'm compris, referring to. La so let me, let me read to you something um, someone from your village qui a été dit par uh, told de investigators of uh, the investigating judge, du bureau that is um, E3-9352. It's the, the second question in this WRI. It's a statement of someone de um, un called Ing On. Ing On. Do you know Ing On? Est-ce que vous connaissez Ing On, Madame? Ing On. I knew. I know Ying On. Réponse. He's still Je alive, Ing and Ing he lives in my village. Et il habite dans mon village. Um, Ying On is being asked a question. On pose une I will read the whole question to you and his answer. Lire toute la question, et sa um, question. question. Did the people in the village uh, discriminate against them, du village them being Vietnamese? And then um, On answers. Previously, there was no discrimination. They respected them normally. They married following the normal customs. The discrimination began in the Lon Nol era. End of quote. 
So, um, Madame Civil Party, this person that you know says Donc, que vous that discrimination against Vietnamese people began in the so-called Lom No era. Is that something that you can confirm or not if you can? I could not recall that well. It's not a problem at all, um, Madam Civil Party. Uh, let me now turn to um, the date of, or rather the day that you said um, your mother saw Je reviens maintenant au jour où vous avez dit que votre away. mère a vu que le uh, nom this morning, menait uh, votre mari à pied. Vous avez confirmé que c'était la saison des pluies de 1977 ou fin 1977. The supplementary information form, dans le formulaire Mr. President, that is document D22-212A, um, English ERN 01166071, Khmer 00584569. This is something uh, you said. In June 2010, <coughs> you said my husband Chu, aged 42, was Vietnamese. He was a Vietnamese soldier. He was arrested and uh, taken to be killed by the Khmer Rouge in 1978. Um, there is some confusion. Uh, Madame Civil Party, whether it was 77 or rather 78. Uh, could I ask you to think one more time uh, whether in your recollection it was 77 or rather 78? It was in 1977. Yes, as I said, it was in 1977. Not 1977. At that time, I was harvesting rice. Um, thank you, Madam Civil Party. Let me follow up with one question. Question. Um, have you ever heard of something? I'm sorry, Council. Can we just clarify the record? I've heard 77 twice. She said it was in 77, not in 77. So, at least in English. Or did I misunderstand? Yeah. So, from the translators, what I heard was, I'm sure it was in 77, not in 77. So what, what did she say? Madame Civil Party, was it 77 or was it 78? Madame la Partie Civile, était-ce en 1977 ou en 1978? What I know is that it was in 1970, says the Civil Party. La Partie Civile, en 1970. I cannot recall the year that well. Je ne me souviens pas bien de la nuit. C'était il y a longtemps. Maybe I misheard, but Maître Coppe, I heard 1970. Prosecution is nodding. Ma Madame Civil Party, did you mean 1977? Oui. Dire 1977? Yes, that's what I meant. Oui, c'est ce que je voulais dire. It was not 1978, but it was 1977. Um, thank you, Madam. Uh, so, but let me follow up Merci. with something um, in this respect that uh, another witness testified to. Poser une autre à ce um, sujet. He also un autre a talked about late 76, early 77. De, de 77. Um, that is uh, witness T2TW848 uh, Tenghui, um, but he said that he didn't know the year of 1978. 
places, these arrests or les lui, walk away, walking away, whatever you would like to call it, before something that he calls quote unquote the Sao Pim event. C'est ce qu'il a fait un lien avec l'événement, ce qu'il a appelé l'événement de Sao Pim. Avez-vous jamais entendu parler de cet événement, cet incident, Sao so, so Pim? No, I never heard about it. Non, je n'ai jamais entendu parler de ça. I never heard of anything to do with Sao Pim. Je n'ai jamais rien entendu parler au sujet de Sao Pim. I didn't even understand that your question. Je ne comprends même pas votre question. Uh, that is no problem. Um, the the is he no also, problem. the same witness, um, said that uh, the walking away of uh, uh, your late, late husband took place, pied, um, quote unquote, uh, before the Southwest Group purged the East Group. Avant que unquote. le groupe du Sud-Ouest a procédé à la purge E3 du groupe Est, c'est dans le document E3/5244. Madame Civil Party, you, s you answered a question earlier this Madame morning Partici, from the National matin, Co Prosecutor that you said that the Khmer Rouge came in 1977. Is it possible that you meant not the Khmer Rouge, but cadres from an area called the Southwest? Khmer Rouge, but cadres from an area called the Southwest? Réponse. I may know something about that. Je peut-être que je sais quelque chose à ce sujet. Yes, uh, he did involve in that event, although I oui, cannot recall all the details. Il a eu rapport avec cet événement, mais je ne me souviens pas des détails. Who was he? Qui il Cette personne à qui vous faites référence dit qu'il a eu à voir avec mean? ces événements. Que voulez-vous dire Réponse. I knew people were involved in it, but je sais que des gens avaient participé, mais je ne me souviens pas de détails sur les personnes. I cannot recall it at all. Je ne m'en souviens pas. Um, thank you, Madam Civil Mettre Party. Merci, um, let me move to uh, another topic, um, and that is uh, the following. Have you ever heard, seen, or uh, experienced uh, in une any way Gunfire or de artillery coup de fire, feu ou de or firing of shells, shelling from Vietnamese territory into en provenance du, camp, du territoire In other words, vietnamien have you ever heard vers the le, of war? le territoire campuchéen, à savoir, avez-vous jamais entendu les bruits de la guerre? I only knew about the war uh, that uh, happened during the Khmer Rouge regime. Because at that time I Khmer fled my village and je me suis after dans mon village. it ended, I fin, returned to my village again. And of course, I did not go mm. any area that you Je refer to suis... as the fertile land or the clan in Khmer. Je ne suis pas allé à cet endroit auquel vous avez fait référence, euh, cette terre um, fertile, cette euh, terre clan. I, I presume you are referring to uh, the month that Vietnamese Je troops que vous invaded ces références au mois où les uh, soldats vietnamiens ont envahi um, but do you le territoire du Cambodge démocratique Vietnamese en décembre 1978. Mais vous souvenez-vous de soldats vietnamiens, de tanks vietnamiens qui auraient pénétré in, dans le territoire cambodgien uh, November 77, en novembre 1977 Un an plus tôt I did not know and I can I recall je it. Ne savais pas, je ne m'en souviens pas. I forgot about it. J'ai tout oublié. I understand one, one last question in this respect. Uh, Madame Civil Party, did you or any of your fellow village members 
que vous et les autres villageois ont jamais eu à vous enfuir, à fuir la violence de la guerre. Avez-vous dû fuir par exemple les tanks ou les soldats vietnamiens Yes, I did, and oui. I fled to another area, oui, je suis and only endroit. after the end of the war, enfui. I returned la to la my village. village. And that was uh, the war that I knew. Ça, la que connu. There were heavy shelling in my area, so I had to flee. Dans la, la région où j'habitais, c'est pourquoi j'ai dû And how la close fuite. was the heavy Maître shelling taking place um, to your village? How close to your village uh, did those grenades village, fall? Ces grenades sont -elles was tombées? it in the village? Was it dans le village? close to the village? Proche du village? Do you remember? Est-ce que vous vous en souvenez? Réponse. The uh, shelling such as for uh, far from my village, but I was afraid so uh, to my uh, family members to flee et ma famille, from my village. De mon village. I remained in the other area until the, the fall of the regime. But how far was it from your village? Mais à quelle distance de votre village? Uh, 100 meters away, was it a kilometer away, or was it more to the next village? Ou était-ce dans l'autre village? Do you remember? Vous vous en souvenez-vous? Réponse. No, non. I cannot recall non, je that. Je ne m'en souviens pas. However, I fled uh, to Mais the uh, nearby area. It was not far from my native uh, qui home. Pas très loin de mon village natal. Sometimes I fled to the nearby village and stayed there for a day or two and I returned. Et ensuite je rentrais à la maison. Do you know Question. whether any people living in your village um, -vous si des gens qui had dans been votre injured or wounded by the gun or artillery fire? Des éclats d'obus ou des balles? I didn't know about that. Je ne le savais pas. But uh, by that time, I had fled. Car à ce moment-là, moi, j'avais déjà pris la fuite. Je ne reste, je n'habitais plus là. I had fled to another village. J'étais vers un autre village. And as I said, I only returned Et after the dit, fall of the regime. Je ne suis rentré qu'après la chute du régime. Uh, thank you, Madam Civil Party. Um, Question. Merci beaucoup, Madame la Partie Civile. My last subject. Je pense que ce sera le dernier sujet que j'aborderai avec vous aujourd'hui. Can you tell us again exactly how you heard? Pouvez-vous nous dire où this thing about children of Vietnamese mothers? Comment vous avez entendu dire que les enfants de mères vietnamiennes were targeted and children of Khmer mothers were not targeted. Who was it exactly that said Khmer. that? How did you hear this? Possible. Qui l'a dit? Can Comment you -vous su? give us some more details about it, please? Vous nous en parler plus en détail? The Cambodian children were not taken away, only the Vietnamese children were taken away, including all the children of a large knee. None of the children of their children were spared. As for other families, they did not have any children. Only large knee's family had several children. That's all I know. I understand, but that's something that you've that you've seen or heard. Um, Mais quelque chose que vous but avez vu what I'm trying to find out whether that was a conclusion Moi, je veux from you si and the villagers or whether it was vous, something that you heard someone say. Ou est-ce quelque chose que vous aviez entendu de la bouche de quelqu'un, notamment peut-être dans une réunion ou à la radio, etc.
réponse. No, I did not hear it. Non, What I je ne l'ai pas entendu. Heard is that, uh, Tout ce que j'ai when they were taken away, they were taken away and they never returned. And I did not know where they were taken revenus, Je ne sais pas où ils ont été emmenés. Uh, I understand. Um, let, let me Question. try it one last time. Je comprends. Was there any, anyone, uh, maybe a village chief or maybe que, someone uh, from eu, qui que ce soit, the security office or chef de village, a soldier du bureau de sécurité, any, un soldat, anyone from the quote unquote Khmer Rouge uh, that said quelqu'un des supposés that Khmer Rouge children of Vietnamese mothers were not safe. Les enfants de mère vietnamienne Do you remember? n'étaient pas en sécurité. Souvenez-vous de cela. Yes. Réponse. And uh, what I know is oui. that if the mother was Vietnamese, the children would be taken si away as well, les enfants étaient and only aussi. the father remained, le père and none of the children were spared. Aucun des enfants n'était pas. That's all I know about this matter. C'est tout ce que je sais à ce sujet. I, I understand. Je uh, comprends. Civil party. I, I think uh, you've said that a few times now. Mais déjà dit plusieurs fois. I'm trying to to understand whether this is something ce que de that you and the villagers si concluded. Est-ce une conclusion? Because it happened. Vous, les autres villageois, avez tiré car ça s'est produit. Ou était-ce quelque chose que vous avez entendu quelqu'un dire Peut-être que l'avez-vous entendu à la radio ou dans une réunion Comprenez-vous la différence entre les deux cas de figure que je viens de vous donner Réponse. I have said what I knew about je it. vous ai dit ce que je sais à ce sujet. I knew that their children, all their children que were taken tous leurs enfants étaient emmenés. And I did not know anything else. Je ne sais rien d'autre. And I also cannot recall anything else. Et je ne me souviens de rien d'autre. Uh, thank you. Maître Coppelier, merci, very last merci question. It's a very small ma question. dernière question. Um, Petite question. Your daughter, um, was she born in 1970? Uh, in other words, between 75 and 79, she between was about 75 and 9 years old. Her age was Réponse. about seven to eight years old. Elle était âgée de She's now 8 45 ans. years old. Elle est à la 45 ans maintenant. Uh, the, the reason why I'm asking, and question. this is my, my last question, um, Madame Civil Party, is pose la question, et ce sera ma um, question. that your mother, her grandmother, c'est que votre uh, mère, sa grand-mère, have told the investigators, the three slash seven, five, five, five nine, eight, eight. 7, 5, 9, 8, your daughter was little then, que votre fille and, était très petite à l'époque et qu'elle ne savait rien. Is that, is that correct? Is it, is it correct that your Est-ce exact? Uh, Est-il really juste de dire que votre fille ne savait pas vraiment ce qui s'est passé entre 1975 et 1979? I I cannot recall that. I cannot recall the month of the year. Je ne me souviens pas du mois et de l'année. Thank you very much, Mr. President. Merci beaucoup, Madame la Partie Civile. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Nous n'avons plus de questions pour cette Partie Civile. Le Président. Thank you, Council. Merci, Maître. The Chamber now hands the floor to the Defence Team for Kills and Pawn to put questions to this civil party. You may proceed. Maître, vous avez la parole. Merci, Maître. Vous avez la parole. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Bonjour, bonjour à Thank tous. You, bonjour, Mr. Madame Dean Un. Good morning, good morning to everyone. Je m'appelle Antagisé, je suis co-avocat international de Monsieur Le Sampan. My name is Antagisé. C'est à ce titre que je vais vous poser quelques très courtes questions complémentaires par rapport à ce que vous avez indiqué aujourd'hui devant la Chambre. Je voudrais revenir sur les fois où vous avez été entendu sur les faits dans votre village. 
Vous avez indiqué à M. le Président que vous avez été entendu par les enquêteurs du bureau des coaches d'instruction. Est-ce que vous vous souvenez également avoir été entendu par des personnes travaillant pour une organisation qui s'appelle DCCAM Yes. Oui. I was interviewed at my house. Oui, j'ai été entendu, euh, ou plutôt, j'ai été interviewé euh, chez moi. Est-ce que vous vous souvenez de la date Do you recall the date of that interview no, I cannot recall non, je ne m'en souviens pas. It happened quite a long time ago. C'était il y a un certain temps déjà. Si je vous dis que c'était en février 2000, est-ce que ça vous rafraîchit la mémoire Non, je ne m'en souviens pas. J'ai oublié. Est-ce que vous vous souvenez si euh, cet entretien a été enregistré euh, sur une cassette de façon audio a cassette as an audio recording. Yes. Oh, oui. Uh, there was an audio record Il, of the interview. Il y a eu un enregistrement de cette interview. Um, je vous pose ces questions de clarification, madame, I parce que tout à l'heure, vous avez, en répondant à mon confrère Copé, sur uh, ce que uh, vous avez dit à l'époque sur... Uh, les occupations de euh, votre mari, vous avez dit « je n'ai jamais dit ça » à propos de son activité de vendeur d'opium. Je voudrais vous relire, pour essayer de vous rafraîchir en mémoire, un extrait de la transcription de euh, votre entretien ce jour-là avec euh, le personnel d'ECCAM. Donc c'est le document E3. Et je vais lire un extrait en anglais puisqu'il n'y a pas de version française disponible. No version le RN en anglais est le 0115771781. Et le RN en Khmer est le 0034081. Voilà la question qui vous est posée. Can you tell us again what your husband did at that time? Ce que votre mari faisait à l'époque. Answer. Réponse. He did not do any business at that time. He relied on the fact that Yoon could enter and exit Cambodia. He was an opium seller. Question. Question. Really? Vraiment? Answer. Réponse. Yes. Oui. During that period, he entered and exited il, Cambodia. Il, il entrait et sortait he had nothing else to do. Il n'avait rien d'autre à faire. He just stayed at home il and the money flew to our home. À la maison et euh, l'argent People came arrivait. to buy at our home to export to Vietnam. Acheter chez nous pour exporter au Vietnam. Question. Question. Did people come to buy opium? Les gens venaient acheter de l'opium. Answer. Réponse. Yes, they did. Oui. He did not do any other business. Il ne faisait pas d'autres affaires. Question. Question. How much did he earn selling it at, at a time? Et combien d'argent gagnait-il en vendre à l'époque? Answer. Réponse. He earned much money. Il gagnait beaucoup d'argent. At the time, Yoon kept flowing to Cambodia. They just came to buy it. Il venait simplement l'acheter. Question. Question. Did he earn much money? A-t-il gagné beaucoup d'argent? Answer. Réponse. Yes, he did. Oui. Fin de citation. End of quote. Ma question, euh, Madame Dean Eun, c'est est-ce que euh, cet extrait un petit peu plus long de votre entretien avec euh, le personnel de l'ICCAM vous rafraîchit la mémoire Et est-ce que vous maintenez toujours que, euh, à cette époque, votre euh, mari était euh, vendeur de volaille Réponse. 
Kau lu main tentang kau lu. That's all I knew that he uh, sold that and I didn't know about any vendait, other uh, business. I only knew that he sold uh, that and the chicken. De la and he only sold it at the house et and they came to uh, buy it Les at the house. Est-ce que, dans ces conditions, vous avez une explication euh, sur l'extrait que je viens de vous lire ou vous ne dites pas ça Est-ce que euh, vous pouvez expliquer comment euh, il se fait que nous avons une déclaration qui indique que c'est une transcription audio de ce que vous avez dit Est-ce que vous pouvez expliquer hein, la différence entre les deux versions I have said what I knew. I uh, did not que know, know sais, anything else. I didn't know what else he sold. Je pas ce president, uh, le president, National Litco Lawyer for Civil Parties, le the principal Cambodgien pour les parties civiles. Le oui, oh, thank you, Mr. President. Merci, Monsieur le Président. In fact, uh, Madame Civil Party en fait, responded to this kind of a question. And the question by Anta Gusset, that is the last Maître two Gisset, questions, les dernières, deux dernières questions de Maître Gusset, were actually put to the Civil Party by a Council Copper. And that is Copper. just uh, my observation, voilà, Mr. President. Um, pour répondre très brièvement à cette observation, uh, mon confrère Copé n'avait pas remark, uh, cité l'intégralité uh, du passage que je viens de citer, uh, donc uh, non, ce n'est pas répétitif, uh, et c'est important de uh, rappeler un extrait plus important de la déposition, uh, de, de, de l'extrait de cet entretien pardon, de Mme Dine Hun pour essayer de lui rafraîchir la mémoire. Je poursuis, j'en aurai terminé uh, par la suite. Let me uh, malheureusement, je n'ai pas uh, la version intégrale de uh, cette transcription audio, mais audio uh, je parle sous contrôle uh, des parties, tout au moins uh, des parties khmérophones, the, the sur, uh, uh, dans le cadre de cette même entretien avec Dissicam, que vous dites que vous, ne, vous, vous avez maintenu aujourd'hui que vous ne saviez pas et que vous ne savez pas quelles étaient ses activités, ce qu'il vendait d'autres. Pourtant, à l'URN, toujours du même document euh, en Khmer, puisqu'il n'existe en Khmer, 0034084, vous donnez des détails très précis sur la manière dont euh, cet opium était conditionné. Ça se retrouve également à l'URN en Khmer, 0034082. Et sur cette ERN en particulier, particulièrement, vous indiquez que c'était important que euh, les choses soient faites en cachette pour que l'autorité locale n'en sache rien, euh, parce qu'il euh, y avait un risque d'emprisonnement. Donc, que ce sera mon dernier point, est-ce que cela vous rafraîchit la mémoire de savoir qu'il y avait eu un moment une activité un peu risquée de votre mari à l'époque hein, qui faisait que vous devez dissimuler hein, cette activité au risque d'emprisonnement Est-ce que ça vous rafraîchit la mémoire No, I cannot recall that. Non, je ne me souviens pas. Even took place many many years ago, and I am now 75 years old, so my memory does not serve me that well. Ma mémoire me fait défaut. And of course, my husband did not involve with the sale of that uh, substance, as you said. N'a pas participé à la vente de ces substances, comme vous dites. Monsieur le Président, je n'ai pas de questions complémentaires. Monsieur le Président, I have no further questions for the civil party. 
an opportunity to make a victim's impact statement for the crimes alleged against the two accused, the Nunchi and Kiev Sampon, and which happened during the Democratic Ambuji regime, and that led you to become a civil party to claim for moral and collective reparations concerning the harms inflicted upon you physically, materially, and psychologically, which are the direct impacts Crimes. And if you wish to do so, si you have the floor now. I was mistreated, I was forced to do uh, hard labor, to transplant seedlings in the rice fields, and my body physically deteriorates until the present time. Mon pays, mon corps est dégradé and the older I get, uh, the weaker I plus become. Je vieillis, plus je deviens faible. Mr. President, Monsieur le Président, I actually uh, made a request uh, to the bench that I should put questions directly to the civil party. possible to poser des questions à la partie civile? That is in reference to document E1 slash 37.1.1. As I stated, that uh, this civil party doesn't uh, speak much, and for that uh, reason, I request to put some questions to her to lead her in making such a response. President, yes, you are aware, Council, this chamber prohibits uh, all parties to put any leading questions to the civil party. In fact, you may put questions to the civil party, but not the leading ones. But um, my apology, Mr. President, may be uh, I made a mistake in my statement just then. And indeed, I, I'd like to put some questions to the civil party in relation to her suffering. President, you may proceed. Mr. Picard. Madame Civil Party, Madame, I'd like to put the following question to you. Vous poser when you questions. lost your husband, Teb Jun Alice Chui, and votre your mari, son, Jun Mon Chui Mian, et votre fils, during Mian, the Khmer Rouge regime, du régime Khmer Rouge, how do you feel? Please express uh, your suffering or your feeling to the court. And so I can respond oui. to that. Oh, I have répondre. a great pain for the loss, and I was forced to engage in perte. all kinds of uh, tasks. J'ai dû faire toutes sortes de tâches. I was used uh, without uh, any break time. On m'a fait travailler in, sans répit. Uh, on m'a fait creuser des terres. On m'a des digues dans les rizières. And at the same time, I lost uh, my child et j'ai perdu my mon husband. fils et mon mari. And that is a great pain for me. Et c'est très douloureux pour moi. And when I think about it, it is vividly in front of me. Et quand j'y pense, euh, c'est un I souvenir also encore. Feel miserable and lonely when I lost my husband. And this is compounded by the fact that I 
I am poor. Et tout ceci est encore aggravé par, aggravé par le fait que je suis pauvre. Question. Question. And after the fall of the Khmer Rouge regime, that is on the 7th January 1979, can you describe to the court of uh, your living condition when you are by uh, yourself with the loss of your husband and child? Answer. I could hardly earn a living. And my feeling was constantly about my husband and my uh, son. I could hardly feed myself from what I earned each day. Question. And uh, lastly, uh, Madame, do you have anything else to add? So Civil Party. I like to seek some assistance uh, from the court since I am uh, very uh, poor. Obtenir du tribunal, I could hardly afford myself with food uh, on a daily pour, basis. Même du mal I am à me tous old les jours, and I cannot use my day. physical strength Et to earn my living. I also have difficulty in walking. Des difficultés à marcher. But um, I don't have any further questions for you, Madame Civil Party and Mr. Madame President. I am done. President. Madame Dong Eun, the Chamber President, is grateful Dong Dong of your time. Du temps que vous lui and avez the uh, victim's impact statement that you, you have just provided and hearing of your testimony is now concluded. And it may contribute to ascertainment of the truth in this case. You may therefore return to your home or wherever you wish to return to. And we wish you all the very best. And the Chamber would also like to thank Madame Tepida, the TPO staff, for your support given to the civil party during her testimony for this whole day. You may also be excused. Court officer, in collaboration with the Wissu staff, please make a necessary transportation arrangement for Dong Eun to return to her house or wherever she wishes to go to. And after the break, we will hear testimony of uh, the witness to TCW 1009. And this witness has Moon Sawan as a duty counsel. Let me have a short break. And uh, we have a break break now and resumed at 3 o'clock. The court is now in recess.